yeah, yeah. Wrestling, I find it's um, um, it's a little bit easier to uh, to 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 get a handle on. You know, uh, like, like it'll take you a, a lot less time to learn how to do a double leg, you know, than to do a a proper uchimata. You know, you <laughs> like you, you tried it once. I like I remember like uh, you put on the gi once, and then like you, you like you're like never again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I I'd love to try and do more judo. Uh, you know, I only came to one class probably like back in 2017, so that's like five years ago. Right. And uh, and I right away, my first uh, opponent was Nick. So I was a little bit outmatched there when it came to judo. That didn't that didn't go too well for me. But um, yeah, I, it, it's hard to find the time. It's hard to find the time to do both. Definitely. And you're right. I find, yeah, the technique, uh, the, the techniques in judo or the, the throws and everything. Yeah, they are a lot more complex than a basic takedown. In wrestling. A basic takedown, you can master a lot more quickly. I agree with you there. Yeah, you know, you know, like uh, one thing that um, uh, that that I'm thinking of um, of, of testing out is 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 going for more of a um, uh, Greco Greco style of wrestling, because because the thing is in judo, like I I, I want it, like I I like I still want to do something in judo, and what I real well I can't grab the legs in judo, right, because of the uh, the rules at all. So right. I'm thinking to myself, but one thing that I could do to maximize my time, like, uh, on the, on the mats doing wrestling is to try to adapt my wrestling to be more of a Greco thing where I'm more, you know, I'm, I'm you know, like essentially I'm not grabbing the legs. I'm, I'm, I'm getting close. I'm grabbing the guy and then I'm just like flipping them. Right. Yeah. Because then for in judo, that would actually be, I could actually use that in judo. So I was thinking about that and I was like, man, you know, um, you know, so so that's why lately I've been I've been kind of like standing up a little bit more upright, you know, at wrestling practice. And with oh, some really? people it works. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Greco is great for judo people. Yeah, it's a great transition. The problem with Greco, if you want to mm -hmm. compete, is that they really barely they have like hardly any Greco competitions in Canada at all. It's almost all freestyle. So the only time you get to wrestle Greco is is at national. Or I think they do a couple of tournaments out west, but then you're talking like Alberta. Uh, you've got to be able to fly out to Alberta for a small Greco tournament. So, yeah, but judo transitions well. You're right. That's why we're going to have all of our wrestlers that are doing freestyle. We're going to also put them in Greco. Yeah, yeah. And, and you know, it was funny because uh, I practiced um, uh, the other day. Uh, you know, like uh, I was talking to Nick, and it, it was funny because the wrestlers were, were – um, like it's funny, but you could you could you could judo the wrestlers and you could wrestle the judokas. 